Hi guys, hope you are doing good guys. In this video I want to talk about how to actually fix OBS PUBG crash. There are a few things you can try. I'll show you first. First thing you need to try is updating your graphics driver. Sometimes you may not have the latest driver and that is you need to try installing the latest driver. If you are a streamer, sometimes you want to do both at the same time on the same PC. You may not have a separate PC setup, right? In that case, if your PC is not that powerful, maybe you should reduce the resolution uh, on both OBS as well as the game. Just go to settings and change the res resolution. So here you can go to settings and change the resolution here. So instead of using, you know, borderless or, you know, here if you click the full screen, you can actually change the resolution of the game. Maybe if you don't have a powerful PC, maybe you should try this, changing the resolution and that could actually fix the problem. OBS will stop crashing as you stream. Up next is, as you launch the game, OBS crashes. And you relaunch OBS and it still crashes you know, as you try to stream. So in that case, what you need to try is if you're using game capture, just double click the game capture and uh, tick this use anti-cheat compatibility hook. This could actually fix the problem. But it could still throw some error like OBS has crashed. You may get an alert window. So what you needed to do is just keep that window aside. Just hide it somewhere in the corner of your uh, monitor. That's it. Don't click yes or no and continue streaming. You won't have any problem. Another way to fix this is instead of using the game capture, use the window capture. So you can actually choose, you know, here you can add several sources like images, game capture. You know that, right? So instead of you using the game capture, click a window capture and create that. So I already have a window capture here. I actually use window capture. Then double click that. You can actually choose the window you want to capture, right? And here in my case, this is uh, PUBG. So, and if you want to capture the cursor as well, you can check the capture cursor and click multi adapter compatibility group as well and click OK. This could actually fix your problem you have. Then it will stop throwing some errors like, you know, this has crashed. Sometimes OBS could still crash as you launch the game. Then you need to relaunch OBS again in that case. Then you won't have any problem. Then another thing you want to try is deleting some of these sources. You know, some of these sources may be completing with PUBG and causing the OBS and both OBS and PUBG shut down. In that case, sometimes mostly it could be some browser sources because sometimes these browser sources actually doesn't work right. In the background, it could keep reloading, causing OBS or the game crash. So in that case, what you needed to do is just delete these browser sources or some other sources. Maybe if you don't have a browser source, but if you see your OBS still crashes, maybe you should try deleting each and every sources one by one and relaunching OBS and this could also fix the problem. In my case, browser source was actually causing the problem. What I did was just I deleted the browser sources and it actually fixed the problem. But the OBS still crashes as I launch the game. You know, instead of uh, launching OBS first, first launch game, then launch OBS. Then things should be fine. You won't have any problem. So these are the few things you could try. Then if you don't have a powerful PC, maybe you should try this tool. The this is the final one you could try, the Auto Configure Wizard. Here, as the, using this settings, Auto Configure Wizard, this will optimize OBS for the best streaming experience. So click, choose any of these options, like optimize for streaming, recording is secondary. Maybe this is the one you want to try. Then click next. Set the base canvas you want to uh, use, like 1080p or 720p. So use current one. So here you have a few options like 60, 30, I mean frame rate. Use current 60 or either 60 or 30 but prefer 60 when possible. This is the one maybe you should try if you don't have a powerful PC, okay? Then click next. And here you need to set your uh, streaming keys. Like you know, if you're streaming to YouTube or Twitch, you need to sign in with your Twitch or YouTube account. Or maybe you should you should use your RTMP server URL and its key. That's it. And click next, and it'll give you a warning like the bandwidth test is about to stream randomized to video data without audio to your channel. So in that case, it's recommended to temporarily turn off uh, saving videos of streams on your channel. 
so that's a good option if you don't want to save the videos on your YouTube or maybe you could actually delete the video later on your channel right then click yes then you'll start streaming some random videos to your YouTube channel it'll actually analyze your PC actually you set the best possible uh, streaming settings for you it could be just PUBG it could be any other game you want to stream you know Fortnite or whatever so that's it guys so these are the few things I wanted to share with you. I hope this helps. Please give it a thumbs up, share the video with your friends and others. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Thanks for watching.